Welcome back to the special edition of What's in Store. I'm Kelly Malone. When it comes to the highly specialized field of urology, only the very best in diagnostic imaging will do. And that's where Hitachi Aloka comes in. Both Hitachi and Aloka have long and proud histories. The Hitachi Medical Company has been in existence for over 100 years. Hitachi as a company is very diversified. You'll see them in transportation, in power, in heavy machinery, and of course medical. The Aloka Company has over 60 years of experience. And over that 60 years, Aloka has been dedicated to diagnostic ultrasound systems. In fact, Aloka is the longest running diagnostic ultrasound company in the world, selling over 225,000 diagnostic ultrasound systems worldwide. Hitachi and Aloka were both independently successful and started off as competitors. But both companies realized that they had synergies together. So in 2006, they entered into a technology sharing agreement. Hitachi then decided to acquire Aloka in 2010. Several new technologies have been derived from that relationship. In fact, two new products were just recently introduced that came directly from that technology agreement. This acquisition by Hitachi of Aloka is actually more of a merger or a marriage of two companies. Both companies have great reputations in the industry. Both companies have a good reputation, good name brand recognition. But the two companies combined now are a stronger company, utilizing its broad products, its people. So we expect great things and I'm very excited about the two companies merging together. Both companies recognize their social responsibility uh, for their communities and for the environment. Recently, with the situation in Haiti and in the situation of Katrina, both companies have not only donated financial support to the area, but also have donated equipment to support the efforts there. We've also sent our own personnel there to support the operation of the equipment itself. In addition to that, most recently, with the tsunami and earthquake in northern Japan, both companies again have made significant contributions to that relief effort, and both companies have again donated equipment to that cause. Both companies have made an effort to become more environmentally friendly through their products. A lot of the composites and the material used in their products are different than in past years. They're using recyclable cartons and packaging in their products and different composite materials. With the merger of Itachi and Aloka as a combined company, we now have a broad range of products and over 40 surgical transducers. One of the strategies that we've used to be successful not only in neurology and other markets is to listen to our users. We visit many local sites and work very well with our luminaries to learn what their challenges are, learn more about the procedures that they're doing, listen to their ideas. And from that, we bring that information back to our R&D people to develop products that are innovative and that hopefully will have a better positive outcome in patient results. It's important to know that ultrasound is certainly a useful tool when it comes to screening for and diagnosing prostate cancers and other cancers. It's also an essential tool in the guidance of many prostate cancer treatments, including cryo, RF ablation, and seed implantation. Ultrasound technology is constantly evolving. Hitachi Aloka helps the American Urologic Association educate doctors and fine-tune their skills. Hitachi Aloka supports the AUA at the local, regional, and national levels and not through their various congresses that they hold each year from an exhibitor standpoint, but more importantly, by the support of their workshops with providing equipment and providing very skilled radiology trained clinical application personnel. These workshops also allow the physicians to have the opportunity to learn about new technologies that aren't even currently available yet. We're very committed to education and support of AUA. Aloka is actually the pioneer in ultrasound is mostly referred to as innovators in ultrasound. In 1960, Aloka developed the first commercially available diagnostic ultrasound system. Over the years, Aloka has continued to provide research and development efforts in innovative technologies, such as 3D and 4D, linear and convex probes, and color Doppler, which is used extensively in all ultrasound diagnostic systems. We continue to develop new products and enhance existing technologies, once again to benefit the medical community. In 2011, with the assistance of urologists and key luminaries, Hitachi Aloka introduced at AUA the first robotically controlled surgical transducer in the world. Intraoperative ultrasound is very important in accurately identifying the location and extent of the tumor. This offers the patient the best cancer operation because it ensures complete removal of the tumor. Traditionally, this has been performed using a laparoscopic ultrasound probe which has to be controlled by the assistant rather than the surgeon. 
Now we have a new robotic ultrasound probe available, which allows the surgeon to control this important step of the procedure. It takes full advantage of the robotic instruments that offer articulation and precision in allowing the surgeon to control the intraoperative ultrasound. This has been a complete game changer for me in my surgeries, allowing me to more accurately identify the tumor even at difficult angles on the backside of the tumor um, and has allowed me to be more efficient in uh, offering ultrasound and gives me more confidence that I've completely identified the tumor. Hitachi Aloka is committed to developing new and innovative products for the diagnosis and treatment of cancers. Their dedication to excellence means patients get the best cutting-edge care. To learn much more, go to HitachiAloka.com.